This $85 million mega mansion for sale in Beverly Hills is one of countless estates constructed by world-renowned developer Mohammed Hadid. It's also one of his favorites because he built it for his most discerning client, himself. Yes, Hadid lived in this palatial pad for about a decade along with his famous family. Was this the house that Bella and Gigi grew up in? They have spent a lot of time here, yes. Hadid bought the 2.2 cliff-top acres from the Sultan of Brunei before custom designing the 35,000 square foot palace you see today. These ceiling heights are like a castle. Mohammed and his real estate broker, Stacy Gutola, gave us the grand tour, starting on the first floor, where you'll find a Parisian-style sitting room, a formal dining room dripping in crystal, and not one, but two family rooms off the colossal kitchen. Now, the details of this house you won't find in any other home. You can tell it was built with love. Mohammed even painted much of the artwork you see on display, including these portraits in the impressive entryway and these landscapes along the grand staircase, which transports you to the six bedrooms upstairs. This one was Gigi's, just down the hall from her dad's personal paradise, a 5,000 square foot master suite, cloaked in custom silk that also includes Mohammed's closet, which could be mistaken for a small department store. It's incredible. But the real fun can be found underground, on the mansion's lowest level. Here, you can raise a glass in the massive wine cellar, or raise the stakes in this leather-bound card room. And if that's not enough entertainment for you, feel free to boogie down in the European-style grand ballroom or chill out in a private theater like nothing you've ever seen before, complete with custom upholstery and intricate moldings and woodwork. I really do love this house. And there's no part of it that Muhammad loves more than this refuge, the subterranean Moroccan room a signature touch that Hadid incorporates into every house he designs. And this one is as authentic as it is extravagant. This room specifically was built totally in Morocco and sent over here to be uh, assembled. The Moroccan room also houses a luxurious Turkish bath and an added surprise you never see coming. Whoa, look at that. Please come in. A secret room with a hidden TV and bed fit for a king. It's soundproof. It's soundproof, that for sure. Of course, if the secret room is occupied, you can always unwind on the estate's pristine grounds. Past the winding gardens and swan-filled ponds is the breathtaking backyard, where the pool looks out to the sweeping views of Beverly Hills and beyond. That's what makes this estate really extraordinary, because you have this whole world charm on top of the city. It's one of a kind. Still, Mohammed says he's ready now to let someone else enjoy his one-of-a-kind masterpiece. And if the high-end design and prime location haven't sold you yet, he says he's willing to throw in a little something extra. Whoever buys it, I will paint the two portraits for him and her. You'll do that? To replace mine, absolutely. That's worth it. That's worth it. With its plush palm trees, Spanish arches, and seashell-studded limestone, this Coral Gables estate is every bit the Florida fantasy. And step beyond its Honduran mahogany front door, and the beauty of the mansion's interior declares itself as each striking element is revealed. What I love about this home is it's classic. It has that Florida feel, but it's new. It's timeless. The 21,000 square foot tropical palace was custom built by an heiress to the Bacardi Spirits Empire. She spent eight years obsessing over every detail, from the Italian Minerva marble floors to the intricate cast iron light fixtures fit for a castle. But when construction was finally complete in 2016, she decided to move elsewhere and sell this luxurious labor of love for 27 million bucks. Although it's listed for $27 million, it costs way above that to build. So they're getting a bargain for $27 million. Is that what you're telling me? Definitely. In true Bacardi style, the main floor of the mansion is perfect for entertaining. 
In addition to the wine cellar and state-of-the-art kitchen, there's also a formal dining room with seating for 14. And a fireplace that pulls double duty in the expansive sitting room next door. There's also a family room big enough for a full-on fiesta. But take a trip up the dramatic staircase and you're transported to a private enclave you'll want all for yourself. The master suite boasts a seating area with a custom limestone fireplace and a massive main room surrounded by terraces overlooking the pool below. But the real showstopper is the master bath, where Ms. Bacardi commissioned a glittering steam room hand-covered in a mosaic of crystal tiles. And the faucets and fixtures? Those are crystal too, made by the masters at Lalique. There's also a TV hidden in the mirror. And speaking of hiding, the giant master closet doubles as a panic room. So you can shut that door, it's bulletproof, and it's got all your wardrobe so you can look good when you come out. Correct. Of course, no Florida mega home is complete without a killer backyard. This one includes a lap pool surrounded by plenty of space to lounge in the sun and the shade, not to mention a 100-foot dock just waiting for a yacht. So peaceful back here. Well, definitely, with this your own private pool, with the luscious landscape and all the private, is your own little private oasis in the middle of Coral Gable. A secluded dominion built by rum royalty? We'll definitely drink to that. This modern waterfront estate is one of New York City's most unique properties. And at 18 million, it's one of the most expensive in all of Brooklyn. One of the architect's intentions with building the home was to bring the outside in. And there are over 80 windows in this house. So every single room enjoys views. And there's plenty to gaze upon inside the sprawling 14,000 square foot home as well. From the colorful LED lighting to the Swarovski crystal chandeliers installed by the mansion's current owner, a Russian socialite with an eye for glamour. The owner first saw them at the Metropolitan Opera and she had to have them. So this is the only home that you can see them outside of the opera. The dramatic decor also includes some high-end imports, like 15 different types of Italian marble, used throughout the home's seven bedrooms and 12 baths. And if you happen to like Bulgarian bronze, this might be the place for you. Over four tons of bronze was brought in for this house. Go walk up the show-stopping bronze staircase, and even more opulence awaits, like the penthouse level lounge and the mansion's million-dollar meditation room. Complete with circular seating for 10, a glass sky dome, and all the signs of the zodiac hand-painted and accented with shimmering lights. With this home, it's all about the details. And the details outside are just as impressive. Just past the 55,000-gallon swimming pool, you'll find the party pavilion and the three-boat marina. But the most astonishing feature just might be the 8,000 square foot mansion next door, which the owners are throwing in as a guest house. Now that's a true Brooklyn behemoth with room to spare.